chapter number 9 surface area and volume today we have cylinder third one cylinder we have already discussed about cone and cuboid in last videos in the case of cylinder you have two equations to learn curved surface area of cylinder is equal to 2 pi r h total surface area of cylinder is equal to 2 pi r into r plus h here value of pi is 3.14 r is radius h is height let's solve a question related to cylinder we have practice at 9.1 question number 7 in this question they have given radius of a cylinder is equal to 20 cm and height of the same cylinder is equal to 13 cm therefore we have to find the curved surface area of that cylinder as well as total surface area of that cylinder if radius is given and height is given we have to directly write the equations then we have to substitute the value of r and h in the equation this is how we have done radius r is equal to 20 cm height h is equal to 13 cm therefore first thing we have to find is curved surface area of the cylinder which is equal to equation 2 pi r h which is equal to 2 multiplied by pi is 3.14 into r that is 20 into h that is 13 which is equal to multiply all the 4 and you will get 1632.80 cm square or you can write square centimeter one and same in the same way we will find next one that is total surface area of that cylinder is equal to equation 2 pi r bracket r plus h which is equal to 2 multiplied by pi is 3.14 again multiplied by r is 20 bracket again r is 20 plus h is 13 then same thing here 20 plus 13 is 33 so here it is multiplied bracket means here it is multiplied therefore here into 33 all the Four. If we multiply, we should get four one double four. That is four thousand hundred and forty four point eight zero centimeter square, or you can write square centimeter. Question is also related to cylinder. Practice at nine point one. Question number eight. The question is curved surface area of a cylinder is thousand nine hundred and eight zero centimeter square. Radius is fifteen centimeter. Therefore, find the height of the cylinder. here one more thing they have given pi value of pi either you can take as 3.14 or if they have given 22 upon 7 you can take this value so both values 3.14 or 22 upon 7 you can use any of these two values uh, when you uh, solve the answers here they have given 22 upon 7 therefore we will directly write the equation for curved surface area which is equal to 2 pi rh from this equation we will find the h that is height curved surface area is already given 1980 therefore instead of this we will write here down 1980 is equal to 2 multiplied by pi is 22 upon 7 multiplied by r is 15 multiplied by h now this 7 is divided here let's take the 7 to this side then it becomes multiplied because here it is divided when it goes this side it becomes divide uh, sorry multiplied therefore 1980 multiplied by 7 is equal to 2 22 15 and h all these are multiplied now we will keep h alone here and rest all the three we will take that side here all the three is are multiplied with each other therefore when it goes that side it becomes divide that is 1980 multiplied by 7 upon 2 into 22 into 15, which is equal to h. Now same thing we will interchange. That is h we will take here and these things we will take this side. Now h is equal to 1980 multiplied by 7 upon 2 into 22 into 15. 1980 into 7 is 1300. Uh, sorry, 13,860 upon 2 into 22 into 15 is 660. One three eight six zero upon six sixty is equal to twenty one centimeter. That is zero zero cancelled, and sixty six twenty ones are 
थाउजेंड थ्री हंड्रेड एंड एटी सिक्स देर फोर हाइट इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी वन सेंटीमीटर